Hello, this is part two. The other day we went shopping. We're actually the same day, but I have to do them on two separate videos, otherwise we'd be on the video for about two hours long. Um, so this is part two. We're gonna upcycle the things we got from Poundland, Riverside in Norwich. And here's the lovely Vanessa! Woo! Vanessa is amazing. So if you didn't watch the other video and you're just like, what is going on here? Well, my name is Kate and I do videos like hauls and silly stuff. And Vanessa is an artist, a fashion designer, designer, maker, -y, maker crafty, crafty, crafty girl. The brain, she's got the brains of um, Einstein. I don't know. <laughs> crafty wise, yeah. Well, thanks, darling. If Einstein was crafty. <laughs> yes, thank you. Brains. But Vanessa's so talented. So what we're going to do today in this video, oh, by the way, we haven't forgotten. Mm. Mug mugs of the, of the day. These are Vanessa's mugs. Love this one. B and M. Flew here. One ninety nine. B and M. Last week. I love it. I flew here on my unicorn. <laughs> Nearly said motorcycle. That's <laughs> a so unicorn. So I love my mug of the day. And that's and kind of like that. a um. What is it? An oil slicky pearlescent marbly effect. I think love that's B and M. I love that one sure. as well. They're both very Cheating. good mugs of the day. I think everything's from Poundland. Oh, apart from. Hobby. We'll show you what we're using, yeah. but basically this is from Poundland. Um, obviously a pound. Kids watercolour paints. And I forgot, I thought I bought this as well, so we're going to be using Vanessa's one. So that's what we're going to be using. And did you say some paper? Uh, not paper today, but yeah. these frames, these are really like cool little frames. There's two in here. They're A, um, A6 and they're glass. They don't have any actual wooden frame on them. They're just pure glass. But what's that is nice is, look, let me just show you what this I love your crafty here. wall. Look at the crafty. Oh, there we go. Oh, oh. That's all right. Is that a crafty wall or a crafty um, like memo board? It's it's kind of like my 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 revolving mood board. <laughs> revolving mood board. Oh, I love it. You've got such good things on there. So there's lots of anything on there that I really like, or that if I've bought and I know I'll forget. I've right. got unless it's on there. Right. If it's hidden away, yeah. I won't use it. So love it. like even this, let me show you. Another so that, board. it came with some flowers, oh. but I really like the way that the leaves have been painted. Oh yeah! So I've just kept it, because I think I'll use that, I don't know when, but it's up here, reminding That's me. That's so clever. Yeah. So clever, and you recycle everything that you can possibly recycle. Yeah, because I'm on a budget, <laughs> like a lot of us are, you yeah, know, yeah. so just watching the pennies. So that's what I did for Kate. Love it. Um, and the the reason why this craft came about was it was um, that wonderful International Women's Day. Yeah. A couple of weeks ago. Gosh. And I did, and I wanted to get involved, but I didn't want to do anything too like full on woohoo. Yeah. And what I did is I did hashtag go girl. And go was, girl! Go girl! Go with girl! You can't say that in like a normal accent, no. can you? Go girl. American. And um, people liked it. Thank I you very it. much. I loved Thank it. Thank you very much. I, lo I loved it! <laughs> <laughs> and um, other things have happened. So without further ado, yeah. let me show you how to do these lovely bluey sky backgrounds and then put your text on top. Right. And a lovely little gift um, for yourself, friends, mums, partners. Job done. Because these are expensive, right? So yeah. I tried to get some off eBay, some like little motivational pictures for my YouTube wall, which I'm still doing, and they were quite expensive. So Vanessa said she could do them, we can make them. So that's what we're going to do today. So we're going to face the camera down here, and yeah. I'm I'm rubbish. I'm not very good. I'm sort of a little She's bit not. arty, She's but I'm not. basic, and I'm and I just want things to happen in a second, and I haven't got a very good attention span. So this is quick, cheap, beautiful art, and crafty is. time with Vanessa Norris. And I'll link her channel below as well, so you've got to go and see her video. And you're going to put this video on as well. Yeah. We haven't worked that bit out yet, because this is the first time we've done this. But it's just fun, isn't it? Yeah. Right, we'll get on with it, and uh, wish us luck. So if you do want to um, have a go, grab one of these, get some paper. We'll do this proper, we'll write a list in the description of what you need. Two for a pound in Poundland, the little frames. Some paper. What else? That's pretty much it. Let's get crafty. Let's get crafty. <laughs> Hello down here. This is trial and error. We're not sure where the um, camera should go. So we're going to try and do this. If it's a bit rubbish on the first go, we're very sorry. Bear we're with us. Trying, Bear uh, with us. We're trying. Can you see journey. this? Can you see it? To create our lovely wash ground, yeah. it's going to look like sky or meadows, is we're going to put the watercolour yeah. onto a plastic sleeve. Now this is just like an A4 plastic sleeve that you put your paper in. 
So if you mix up a bit of cream like this. Oh, I see. So you're putting it on the... Straight on oh. like that. Well, you go ahead, Kate, and get some more green oh, on there. And I'll so do with one this myself. one, this is mine, yeah? Yeah. And you've got that other green there. Okay. Do, I, do we add more water? Yeah. And just go like this on yeah. here? Yeah. Okay, is that enough? Yep, that's a bit fine. More. And what we're going to do is we need to, with this... Oh, yours looks nice. Thank you. Ooh. This is going to go onto here. Right. In order oh. for the colour to spread well, you have to make this wet. We're going to be using one of these little um, spray pumps that did come in a makeup doodle. Did it? So, I'm oh, right, cassette of five for yeah. travel. Uh, 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 Got it. So, cover your, cover your paper. It's quite warm up here, I might, might use it on my face. <laughs> yeah, should we do that? Oh, that's better, isn't it? Oh, oh, that's quite nice. <laughs> that is lovely. <laughs> right, yeah, there we go. right now, much? can you see the paper's lifting up slightly? Oh, I can. Right, right, you're good to go. Oh, Vanessa. Yes. Just before we carry on, is this normal paper? Have this we is cartridge. No, we didn't. You're right. So this is a sketchbook. It's not yeah. um, really expensive cartridge paper. It's probably about this. It's classed as 150 grams, I think, the weight. Could you use a like normal paper from Poundland A4, or does it have to be sketch? You could, but it will buckle. Okay. Um, this will buckle, but you can actually iron it, and I can show you. Oh that wow! Later. Iron it. Yeah. Because you can get these in home bargains quite cheap as well. Right. Sorry. Um. Should I put this? Right, yeah. Do I put this back in the jar? Anyway. Okay. In the water. So now I'm taking this. Yeah. And I am just putting it on like yeah. that. Yep. Yeah. Right. Yep. Yeah. Oh, got my hair in it. It's all right. <laughs> Adds to the art. <laughs> so try and. Look, out. some blues coming out. Yep. Yeah. Oh, is that that was already on oh. when I did it? So uh, <laughs> oh, I, I quite like it. I don't know if that will go onto the paper. It might not. So you just smooth it out. Now it looks quite dense in colours at the moment. Yeah. But when you peel it off, it's not as. Thick. Is mine okay? Have I done that? Yep. Does yep. it matter at all? Well, let's have a look. And then if we don't like it, we'll put it back on. So it's quite watery. Quite, yeah. That's nice. I like that. So if you left it on for a little bit longer, yeah. the, the paint would penetrate into the paper a little bit more and become darker. Oh, okay. But if you take it off now, you've got more of a subtle effect. Right, okay. And don't forget, once this is dry, you can always do it again. Yeah. And then again and again. Oh, okay. So we're just going to put that here now. Okay. And then we're going to get the hairdryer out and blast us out. Oh, I like yours. Why does yours look better than mine? Because I've been doing it for about 35 <laughs> years, love, and I should think it bloody well <laughs> But if you're not sure whether it's dry or not, you just tilt it up to the light. Okay. And how's your... Right, you've still got a little I've bit got of wet, wet bits. So we do need to, to dry it completely because if you get a smudge, it does tend to ruin it. Right, I don't want to... No. So we've got dry grounds now. Lovely. And you can add your text on here, your yeah. positive quote. Sometimes I have felt and found with this that it, you kind of need to see what it could like look like in a frame before you put the words yeah. on it kind of helps you yeah. where to place the words oh that looks pretty yeah so straight away it looks yeah, better doesn't it, it? Does. So yeah happy with that place with that placement darling i'm happy with it i like a, a bit of imperfection there. i like that right That's so we're good. just now putting a couple of little marks this is so good doing this with you Thank you, darling. It's nice to have you. I would never think of any of these. And then look, you can things. move it and you know where it is. Right. All right. And we're going to be, and I'm going to just draw. So this, you can see, yeah. you're going within these lines. Are you going to use this one? I think I want to do blocks. Yep. Yeah. I'm going to do a print with the blocks that Vanessa um, got from Hobbycraft. Like she made this. This is a little magnet. Isn't that cute? I love that. Can we do magnets as well? Gorgeous. Oh, gotcha. I love it. Right, so what so have we got here? I'm yeah. going to be using this. They're from Hobby Car. You can get loads of different print drops. They're quite big ones, those. I think they come in about a couple of quid. Right. Um, but again, always test on a spare piece of paper because some are a lot darker or a lot paler than you think. Right. So you can test some like little stamps we're going to do. Yeah. Okay. So you're going right. to do... Your words. Yeah. What were your words? Be kind. Be kind. So Actually, I'm just going to do be kind, not I even think that's nice. be cool. Right. What what colour should I use? Black. Yeah. Yeah. So do a bit of black on there first. I have seen these in Poundland, I think, like with the kids' stamps. 
Oh, that's good. Love that. Like Can that? I have that? I actually think that's nice and yes, black. Yes, I do. So that was meant to be. Yeah, it was. Meant to be. Okay. So just, again, have a little practice. Okay. And then do I just do it anywhere? Yeah. Oh, that way. So when thinking about where to put your text, you always have less space here than here. Okay. If you have got too much space there at the end of the day, put a heart. A heart, I love. Can yeah, I do a little heart? Yes. You know, there's always little tricks of the trade. Oh, I like this pencil. It's got a diamond cool. on the end. It's got a diamond on the end. <laughs> love that. <laughs> okay. So, would you try? No, you just do a little thing here. Like, yeah. could I? Yeah. Just write, be kind. Should I do the B E first? Should I go for it? Yeah. Have I got it the right way? Yeah. Remember, you can always do others. So it's, you know. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> and then do I just put this back yep. and get the E? Okay. Have you ever done it the wrong way? Yes. <laughs> Is that why you practice? Yeah. I've okay. made loads of mistakes. Do I do it straight next to it? Not necessarily. Sometimes it's nice to. Oh, it's a look bit, at that. It's yeah. got a little square yeah. around it. You know, oh. things like that just happen. <laughs> Oh, I love it. I love it. That's so great. I love this. It's good. Okay. So kind now needs to be kind of around there. here. So you know you've got four letters in there. So you want one to be around here, D to be there. Okay. Okay. So I'll get a, a kick inker. <laughs> oh, this is great. Okay. I'll just do a little... No, that's back, back to front. Okay. So I'm going to go here. Yeah. Love it. Lovely. Love it. And I. And always it. check. Yeah. Do you know what? Because I looked at that and I thought, right, the little plastic thing's going to be over this side, isn't it? Mm. Well, actually, <gasps> quite. So you have to be a bit aware of where it is. So you have to have a little check so you know you've got to be a little bit over. But that's right. all, just, all okay. just practice. And okay. Maybe that's too much information and not needing to know that bit. But no, I think it all helps. Yeah, okay. I'm going there. Yeah, oh, see, I, I like the frame like, again. I like it. Yeah. And it's like accidental art. Yeah. And he's an M. Have you got all the letters here? <laughs> Imagine if you didn't have one of them. <laughs> big, big kid. Big, like big A or... high. Or big kid. Big kid. That's all right. <laughs> okay. I'll just make sure that's the right way. I don't know why I'm whispering. Yes, it is. Because you're concentrating. Okay, I'm going to go. I like this um, blue, by the way. Like a peacock blue, I think. Oh, look, I did it. I didn't get the box. I love it. <laughs> and then you could press a bit harder and get maybe the get D. the box for the D. Get a yeah. nice dog. See, all these ideas, brilliant they person. do come. Yeah. Okay, got that right. Yeah. I'm going to get quite a lot of ink for my D. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Hooray! <gasps> I love that. I like that. That's lovely. And right, like, just I to have another look. It. Just to... Get the frame on it again. Be kind. That's great. I really like that. And even the little brass, not brass, oh. but the little metal, yeah. when they add yeah. a bit of detail, I thought that when do. I saw um, the one you did with the yeah. dreams, I thought the same thing. I love that. Vanessa's given me this pink one, um, that ink pad, and I'm going to use a little heart stamp. This is great. And you, should I just do it underneath, kind of there? Yep. Wherever you want. Doesn't really matter if it's no, not it doesn't. perfect, does it? No. Lovely. Aww. Lovely. So sweet. Be kind. Oh, I love it. So cute. That's going to go on my YouTube wall. Yay. Was it easier than you thought? Yeah, a lot was easier. It? It's really, oh, it's enjoyable, isn't it? Yeah. Well, this is the pack of two you get from Poundland, so I'm going to use one of them for my little frame. Kate asked me to write her a few um, positive quotes in frames that she was going to have off me and that's very nice of course you can use them but I couldn't help but feel I wanted you to do your own yeah because it is a new wonderful journey what you're doing and to have this on your YouTube wall and to see it every day and know that you did it is the best feeling. Oh, a little bit. I, I put my little heart yeah. and soul this into is it mine. created this it. This is mine. And Aww. it's just, it, you can't top it. Oh, thank you for showing me. You're very welcome. To, to You're say very... that, I thought there some lovely words there from oh, Vanessa well, Norris. Hello, I'm down low. Um, <laughs> Vanessa's about to cut this out the proper way. Um, and then I said, 
if you were at home and you just use scissors, uh, would that be okay? And she's got now a top tip of using scissors to cut photos, um, so we, like to cut things out. So here we go. So yes, of course, you know, scalpel and steel rule, not everyone's got them. Not everyone wants to have I them because they're really that. sharp and scary. So if you haven't got that, of course, scissors. And just start, go towards one of the corners. I didn't just, know that at all. And just... Is that how you should cut most things out? No, I muscle. just, that's my gut. My gut says do it that way. So I listen to my gut okay. and I'm just getting rid of that out of the way. And then look, you just... Okay, so are you ready? This is what I have made and I'm very proud of myself. I really like it. And so I put it on my be. YouTube wall. So cute. And that is just literally um, 50p frame from um, Poundland, two for a pound, some watercolours from Poundland a bit of sketch paper and some little stamps and I think that is beautiful. Thank you, Vanessa. And I've got the little things I can hang it up yep. there. I love that. Thank it's you. It's really lovely. Very much. And then we're gonna come back and show you show what you have made as well. Yep, so I love okay. that. Thank you. Ta da I'm so pleased with what I have created today. I love this little picture frame. It's gonna go on my YouTube wall. And it's all thanks to the lovely Vanessa. You're very welcome. Thank you. You're very welcome. And this is Van Vanessa's one that she did. So we did dream plan. How cute are they? And they look really nice together. 50p each and then a little bit of watercolour paint and a bit of ink. So what do you reckon about 55p? Yeah, probably. Something 55p? like that. 55p? 54? 54.5. <laughs> <laughs> I really love that. I'm, I'm going to go and buy some um, little stamps now from Hobbycraft. Really pleased with those. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Vanessa Norris. You're very welcome. Oh, so we're going to try and do um, some crafty videos with Vanessa every... Should, are we saying every month? Yeah, I do. Well, I'd like every to do two it. weeks. Yeah, every two weeks. Yeah, every, every two, two weeks. weeks. Yeah, yeah. And then if um if you like them and uh, they're quite good, maybe we can do one a week. Yes. And then one every day. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> no, I really enjoyed because when I was younger, I did used to be quite arty and I I did lots of drawing, drawing, little pictures. I don't know. Yeah. I loved it, and um, it's quite nice getting in touch. Not that I really did much, but I, I really I love doing that. So thank you, Vanessa. You're so welcome. cheers for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and go and have a go. You probably already got these watercolors from Poundland, or you might not have. I don't actually. Poster paint would work. Poster paint. Oh yeah, paint. Just, just water it down. Any paint. And then use a plastic thing. Yeah. And I'll write a list of the things you need underneath. Um, and I'll also put a link to Vanessa's um, channel. And she's going to do a video as well. So you can see it from her perspective um, of what she did and how, how she came to that, uh, to the picture. <laughs> so <laughs> um, I've really enjoyed doing this video. It's been great fun. So thank you very much for watching. Um, if you did like it, give it a thumbs up and write me a comment as well to say if you liked it and um, subscribe. I'd love it if you have haven't subscribed no i wouldn't love that i would love it if you did subscribe if you haven't yeah that's good and any any maybe any suggestions of things you want to see us do together yes you know anything in pound land that, that yeah. you know it's like, oh my god what am i going to do with that yeah. uh you know or any questions yeah and please fire away also like if there's a something you've seen that you want to recreate vanessa is fantastic so we're going to do a marble thing soon yeah um so anything you see that you want to create maybe send a picture on instagram or tag us in it yeah and um we can try and make it and vanessa just maybe just tag vanessa in it because she is the creative lady and she's gonna be doing loads of videos on how to make things and i'm just gonna pop up here and there so thanks for watching and we shall be back soon and go and visit vanessa and subscribe to her because she's bloody amazing thank you yeah bye, bye.